Travis Town. We have two songs to clear here, which is Travis Town and Hand in Hand. Um, Travis Town should be a relaxed. Oh, I, I, uh, what, uh, no, no, hold on, hold, 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 hold on. I have a thing to know. Stop. Chat box. I, I need to add a chat box. Chat box. We, we put chat box there. Ah! <laughs> that was just in time. I don't know if the chat box is working. I really hope that it is. I cannot check. Because I'm focused on the damn game. You know what? You don't actually need to listen to the music that badly. I, I, I'm trying to see if like the, the rhythm of the, the inputs matches the, the music very well. And it matches it well enough. But it's like, it's not very accurate necessarily, I feel. Then again, I, my, my like rhythm is usually way off, so it might be exactly on point and I might just be bad. But I feel like it's not quite on point, honestly. Wait, but don't like if you cannot jump. What? Yeah, okay, no, no, it's actually, it, it's pretty, it's pretty on B. It's easy to tell with, uh, with things where you don't have to worry about pressing things at the wrong time. I guess if you get a rainbow accident, that's actually when you're on beat. And I'm not getting a lot of those. <laughs> so that's probably the issue is what I'm assuming. Chat box is working. Okay, that's real good to know. It's also not staying on screen, which is also real good for me uh, for editing purposes. Uh, I got an item. Is that because I did well? Or is that just how this level ends? I only got what? I only got one of the of the stars. Let's see. Uh, we got a hit all star targets with a rating of excellent or clear um, blue notes or with difficulty. Oh, there's di di oh, of course, there's different difficulties because why wouldn't there be? Wait, can I change the difficulty? Where can I change the difficulty if I can? Presumably in some menu somewhere, right? Music stage settings. There's actually volume sliders. Holy crap! It, it is the best Kingdom Hearts game ever. It actually has volume sliders. Uh, directional uh, button settings. Uh, directional button settings again. Guest characters on or off. Background music timing. Oh, you can actually... Oh, that is very interesting. You can offset the timing for the music. So if it is off and you're doing it specifically based on the music, or if like you know that you're always like half a second late, you can actually adjust for that. That's very interesting. You've got Team Classic, and I assume that when we get to those specific worlds, we uh, we get introduced to the other trios. I like the idea that you can actually offset uh, the music timing a bit, though. Why? Why am I drunk? Is it a bad idea to be able to offset the music if you're just bad? <laughs> it's a it's a very niche issue. I admit that, and I'm not really relying on the music itself, admittedly, because I'm talking over it a lot, which makes it very hard to use it for rhythm-based issue. Uh, that's my bad. Um, but I can definitely see that being somewhat useful sometimes. Right? 
Oh, claiming that this is the Baskin Hearts game. Look! Three left a bad taste in my mouth. That's all I'll say. This is not Battle Line 3. Before anybody like wants to murder me, this is not Battle Line 3. Do not worry. I don't think this is Battle Line 3. I'm just saying it has adjustable volumes like this, which every game needs. Every game needs adjustable volume slides. Why don't you? Ha it's again a very niche issue because sometimes I want to have cutscenes without music, and games don't always give you that option, and it's really annoying because then you have to filter out the music, and that then fucks over the audio quality for the voices, and you can hear that, and it still doesn't sound quite right. And it's again the niches of niche issues, but it's something that this game may actually be able to help me with if it's theater mode is actually more than just the Kyrie cutscenes because those Kyrie narration cutscenes are again this is literally just a filler episode it's just a recap episode which we kind of figured right Then again, there were some cutscenes with Kairi in the final world in the trailers. Presumably that is the end of the game. This is a niche game for some people that can enjoyment... Um, that and some people can get enjoyment uh, from Kingdom Hearts 3. Um, if you enjoyed this more than 3, you have issues. Um, can you check theater mode if it's already present? I, I would assume it would be in here somewhere, right? But... Maybe not? I'll check. Hold on a moment. Loading screen's taken uh, a moment. Okay, so we can go back. World tour. Ah, and then we have track selections. We play specific tracks. Um, versus battles. Museum. Clearest song in track selection to unlock. Oh, so you need to beat everything twice. Obtain 10 fuel battle songs to unlock. Ah, oh, that seems tedious. Um, you have good co-op. I don't have any friends. And change various settings. That's probably the same menu we were just at, right? Menu volume. Music stage settings. Tutorials and help. Copyright info. Let's read through this. Fuck that. <laughs> um... There's one more back button. Let's see what that does. That makes a lot of sense. So, uh, I don't know where theater mode is. Probably theater mode unlocks... When you beat a game? I don't know. It doesn't seem to be already present. If you can figure out where theater mode is, I'd be very interested to hear that. But right now, I think we're uh, going to be uh, fighting... God armor? Maybe? No? Still no boss fights? Just a normal stage? That's fine. So for anybody who's watching this on the YouTubes, uh, this is not going to be a very commentary heavy let's play in general, just due to the fact that there's a lot more um, focusing that needs to be done. I, I, the muscle memory of Glide, it keeps fucking with me, I'm, I'm so sorry. Um, just due to the fact that I actually need to focus in order to perform at least somewhat not horribly. Which uh, so far seems to be going decently well. Maybe as we go along I'll be able to uh, go a little bit more in depth with my commentary. Though, I must admit, I'm actually doing better than I initially expected. I'm still going early on a lot of these uh, fights, or attacks I should say. But at least not way early, right? And sometimes I even get a triple... Triple? Purple? Rainbow? Not purple, rainbow. See, I can either know what I'm saying, or I can do well. I, I can't do both at the same time. It, it's physically impossible. Or at least improbable. <laughs> Though, if for any series... 
I would have wanted a game like this. It probably would have been Kingdom Hearts, because I, I love Kingdom Hearts' music. And frankly, this might be a decent way to get the music I need for... Well, specifically this review as well, right? Um, in a higher quality than downloaded from YouTube. Because downloading them from YouTube, they're very compressed like MP3 format. Admittedly, the review is going up on YouTube and it's only background music, so it's probably not a noticeable quality difference, but I care about compression. Gamer Studio Neo can't find anything on the wiki or YouTube or uh, news articles. We'll figure it out together. We shall figure this out together indeed. Clear without items. I don't even know how to use items yet. Having been chosen by the Keyblade, Sora teamed up with Donald and Goofy. The trio traveled together through many worlds, locking the world's keyholes in order to keep them safe from the encroaching darkness. Kyrie does Meanwhile, sound very bored. Riku awoke in the dark depths 